26, the Festival of Resistance of Stop Dicey 2019. So we're coming down to be part of this big mobilisation to show how all of our different struggles, whether we're Quaker pacifists or whether we're environmental activists, whether we're in solidarity with Palestine or Kurdistan, all of these struggles come together in this arms fair. I will not speak to the police. No comment. So we are here today to offer our solidarity with other people who are also struggling against serious forms of state violence and state oppression. The British government has actually sold a lot of crowd control weapons to the Hong Kong government, which the Hong Kong police force have used indiscriminately um, throughout the last couple of months. Today I'm here with the London Kurdish Assembly and the London uh, Kurdish Youth Assembly. We are here to protest against the arms trade that has been oppressing our voice and our people. And today you have Turkey threatening the Kurds in northern Syria with just an illegal, illegitimate invasion and the arms that they will be using will be the arms that they are trading here today. Arms and anything which encourages conflict and war for the sake of profits is obviously in direct contravention of what we as health professionals and as people are about. I'm from Saudi Arabia and where I come from, the royal family is oppressing people. The armed fairs here, it helps this, the repressive regime. Weapons bring only destruction and death. They will never bring peace. 